Hi folks, in the last video tutorial I have shown you how you can create and reuse the offset feature, extrude feature or round for the intent edges and also automatic orientation into the sketch. I'd like to focus and continue on your question how to build the 3D model like this and now we would like to focus on the second question how to create this complicated shape. We are using the difficult shape yeah it's not straight so i'd like to show you in creo immediately how you are able to create the intersection curve or projection curve and how the system calculate with the dimension so i would like to show you it will be another model so model 2 for example will be name and over here i will really easy create the revolve feature and only for the explanation yes yeah, so something like this i will create a line what does it mean we will create a surface yeah right now the system would like to change it to the surface and for example we will use the symmetric orientation and like this because we would like to see the intersected curve or projected curve so for now i will show you that we have a two possibilities how to create the curves and why because then on the existing curve we will use the sweep feature so let's have a look on this explanation if you will use the intersection what does it mean you are able to create a datum plane or the additional surface and with the if you use the function intersect you are able to select surface or quilt and in the intersection the system will create necessary curve for you okay curve is created and now we would like to make the pattern feature of this curve so I will select the pattern feature and directly we are able to select the direction and will be perpendicular here and some value and for example five times so at the end the result will be not good you can see here where the curves are created they are not following the shape yeah so we have to delete this pattern and the curve has been created between datum plane and the surface so altogether select please the datum plane and intersect make a group and now from this group if you use the pattern feature and for example we will reuse this dimension for example 50 and I will use the five members yeah maybe opposite direction minus 50 then if I will finish all together and shape of the curve will be good yeah as you can see now the curves is continue the shape of the selected surface so it's better simple to say for the intersected curve please include also datum plane or uh, the additional surface and then make a pattern and the system will and make the following the surface if we will use the offset uh, if we will use the projection yeah i will use the another example projection we will project the sketch and sketch will be defined on this sketch plane we are able to create a line yeah simple line you have to be careful that if you will pattern here the line has to be bigger yeah because the system will use this full line and then pattern so we can simply create a bigger line as needed and this curve will be projected on this surface perpendicular to this datum plane so now the curve is created everything is included in the feature so if you use the pattern and you will specify it, for example minus 60 yeah because we would like to go inside and for example 5 altogether and confirm the curve again will be created properly yep so over here was explanation what kind of functionality we are able to reuse and now back to our 3d model and create similar logic here so what does it mean if we need a surface for intersection we need to create the surface select the first one and with control button select the all additional surfaces 
and then simple Ctrl C and Ctrl V, copy and paste, and surface is created. Everything fine. Now we have said that we are able to use the projection. So for example, project and project the sketch. We will specify sketch plane and over here we will create a line. For example, here. Yeah, a little bit bigger. OK. And projection surfaces will be directly on these surfaces. and perpendicular to over here. Yeah. You can project, you can intersect it up to you. I have shown you that you are able to create a quilt if necessary. Uh, I like to continue with the pattern. So this projection can be patterned and then we will specify for example minus 60 for example and simple we can say that for example will be a times so what does it mean now we are able to see that system is continue and follow the surfaces and everything looks good so what does it mean on the first curve if i will create for example sweep feature on the first one and over here we will create the simple shape for example rectangle and I will mirror on the another one and we will finalize the triangle maybe we can specify the dimension to 60 and confirm OK the shape will be as needed and if we will right now use the pattern the system will automatically create a reference pattern and everything will be created as needed as you can see right now it's everything about the dimensions so if you will specify the proper dimension the your shape will looks like neat yeah like you need and also the bottom surface is really similar to the picture what i have seen here yes yeah, so something like this if you would like to use the first shape differently you can create new offset feature and then mirror on the opposite side it's up to you and over here, simple create cat by extrude and everything is fine. Yep. So over here, you have seen in this example how it is possible to create a pattern feature for the difficult shape and also to understand the difference between intersect and pattern or the project and pattern. And also you have seen how it's possible to create the sweep feature with a reference pattern. Thanks again for a question. I hope so that you have found everything what you want. It was a quick example how to use and build your 3D model. Thank you again for a question. Stay tuned and bye bye. Vladimir.